Okay. Not allowed to go see you in that room either, okay? Doors are locked. Vincent, goodbye. That all you ever think about. Well, excuse me for trying to be helpful. So Vincent isn't available at the moment. Interesting. Oh, piano. Can I play it? I want to play that piano and I want a new song other than the Chocobo song. Or the Luck Two Legs. I think it was the Chocobo song. Though. Item. Okay, next stop, the temple. That's you not a good place. Materia? I'm coming for you. Oh man, my rep's gonna go through the roof. Well, it ain't like it could go down. Hmm? <laughs> oh. oh, it's all. Yeah. So, <laughs> where is it? What's the matter? You ain't been bluffing this whole time, have you? No, that's not it. We could go there right now, if you really wanted. Mm -hmm. But before that, would you mind a quick trip to the saucer? What? Why would oh, we're about to go to chapter 12. To even set foot inside the temple, we'll need to get our hands on a relic called the Keystone. Trouble is, it's been missing for nigh on 20 years. Mm -hmm. So, any guesses as to where it was last seen? The saucer. The gold saucer. I know bingo. It's a stretch. No denying that. But it's the only lead I've got. Then let's follow it. We trust you. You do? Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Well, if we got her. Once we're good, let's get a move on. Right. It sounds like a, hey, prepare for what you got to do before going to the saucer. I think the saucer is the next date spot in Chapter 12. I believe. <laughs> I could be wrong, though. What's this? Shinra. Can I put on your bike? That's not like you. I'm not going with you, so back off. <laughs> you misunderstand. I'm defying my boss to be here, because I've got a hunger that cannot be denied.
the one on one or what is it? My desire to see you has driven me on. That's what I get for redlining the old engine. Alright, my friend, it's the final lap. So let's con it one last time! He's mine! Nice move, George. I'm in danger. Go, Roach. Fight, buddy. Uh oh, no, Roach. You okay? Uh, 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 I won't have your pity. This is a race, remember? Come on, Cloud. We're on the home stretch. <laughs> Good match, Roach. There's no escaping the degradation, my friend. What? Black materia. Dream on. That materia is mine. Shut up, Yuffie. There's no escaping the degradation. Hi, Saber. That won't happen to you. Don't worry. Yeah, she's right. You're going to be just fine. Come on. The gilded saucer awaits. And the keystone. Yeah. I bet it's taken almost six hours to get through this chapter. <laughs> Which is insane. <laughs> Shinra's logo thingy. That's the Wuta. Supporters of the Shinra Resistance Committee. 
My name is Glenn Lodbrock, a representative of Wu Tai's interim government. The hour is upon us when we must rise up to confront tyranny. <laughs> Sounds way too close to our own government. Mere days ago, Junon's cannon rang out. A message. A declaration by Shinra's new president that he, like his father before him, would rule by fear. What's more, we recently learned that he had sanctioned the development of living weapons grown within the Mako reactors that provide power to your homes. Alarmed, we decided to seek answers. And in accordance with the ceasefire treaty, our government sent officials to investigate. Shinra promised their full cooperation. However... But when our inspectors duly arrived, they were mercilessly slaughtered. The footage you are about to see was taken from inside one of the reactors. military might. Nevertheless, a righteous fury burns in each of our hearts. A fire that we may carry to Midgar. And there, together, put the city of Mako and Misery to the torch. Yeah. This is our answer, Rufus Shinra. We are ready to march. And to lead us. Wutai's commander, Viceroy Saru. Who's that? Exactly, is this Saru, the Invisible Man? No, worse. Regrettably, we have no intelligence to present at this time. <laughs> then you clearly aren't looking hard enough. Look harder, ma'am. What about that Glenn? What's his name? Glenn Ladbrock, ma'am. Ex-soldier. P0 class, a prototype. 15 years ago, he was sent to Redora on a geological survey, which ended in failure and led to his defection. <laughs> a spineless deserter nursing a grudge, then. Subsequently, Lotbrock took to the road, seeking to forge connections with others who shared his anti Shinra sentiments. <laughs> if you mean Avalanche, they're dead and buried. They're not. I'm afraid I do not, sir. The fall of the Republic triggered a spate of uprisings in the surrounding regions. We suspect the SRC is largely comprised of forces who were defeated during the unrest. Well, who could blame them? They fought against the Republic in the name of freedom. But when the smoke finally cleared, they found themselves under the heel of a new oppressor. Why, I'd be more surprised if they didn't hate us. <laughs> That's not the best thing to say there, buddy boy, but, you know, hey. Pity about Saruf. Would be good to put a face to the name. That's for these. The Ancient is en route to the temple as we speak. Pursuing her is our top priority. She will mm. guide us to the promised land. One way or another. Hmm. Mm. 
Regarding the speech, sir, many will interpret it as a declaration of war. And given that it was a worldwide broadcast, it would be prudent to issue a response. I intend to make a statement. Some, if you would. Sir. So, how exactly are we supposed to get back to the salsa? With all the mountains and valleys in between, definitely not on foot. It's just way too far. Thoughts? We fly back, duh. We've said. I haven't thought of that. Look, smoke. Maybe someone's trying to call for Sid? If so, let's hitch a ride. Not a bad idea. So check it out. How very astute of you! How While very they're not astute in any of you! Hurry, they do appear to be heading toward a specific location. Should you find the time, I ask that you track their movements, see where it is they're going. Oh, whatever. We could very easily do that proto relic part, but we don't need to. Okay. I don't think we're going to be blocked out of or locked out of the chapters if we go here. So that is uh, just there. Hey. Stood up? Nope. Waiting on you folks. Something I wanted to ask. Oh. About your mother. Her name's Afona, right? Maybe. So what? That sounds like a yes to me. I called it the second I saw you. Boy, am I ever glad I sent up smoke. Tell me, how's she doing? Good? No. She's dead. No, she isn't. This weird multiverse thing has her alive. You know, the whole reason I joined Shinra was to become a pilot. But I wound up as a gopher for some lazy grease monkeys. Had me running around HQ fixing lights and whatnot. One time, though, I came across a pretty young thing with a little girl in her arms. That was you, wasn't it? Probably. <laughs> knee had with Tomberry. I was what? Called a smogger, I'd wager. <laughs> Damn. I'm on the willis. That's a crying shame. Truly. Hey, Missy. It's Aerith. 
Eric, is there anything I can do for you? We need to go to the Golden Saucer. I want to help. What? Why? I'm just trying to do right by you. <laughs> Flying us around will be more than plenty. Thanks. Then again, if you're just dying to help, you could take us to the saucer for free. Free? It's fine, we'll pay. No, it's on me. This one's on me. When you want to head to the saucer, just give me a holler. I think the saucer is the start of the uh, next chapter. I believe. Let me see what time it is. It's almost 12.30. I'm going to call it there. I think the saucer is like the next 